In today's video, I'm going to be talking about social media and I'm going to be talking about my experience and how I've managed to literally not scroll on TikTok or Instagram for around a month now, I'd say. It's either a month or a couple of months where I've literally not scrolled on Instagram for a single minute, not scrolled on TikTok for a single minute. I can say that with complete honesty. Um, and let me tell you, I was an avid TikTok addict, as I'm sure many of you are, because it's just so addictive. Just you first you've got to remember that there's a reason why these platforms are so addictive. One of the big reasons is the fact that it's infinite scrolling and the fact that, it, that there's not a point where you come to the end of the page and it says, do you want to continue? Because then you'd have to actually make the conscious, conscious decision, okay, I want to continue to the next page, but they, they don't allow for that. They allow you to continue scrolling for eternity. That's one of the main reasons it's so addictive. Um, and I want to tell you how I managed to completely eradicate social media from my life. And when I look back, I remember the days where I was just I was just lying in bed, scrolling on TikTok, not enjoying any of the videos I was watching. I'm sure many of you can relate to this. And then getting the, getting the thought in my in my mind after about God knows how long it was, because the time just seemed like. The time just I was just I was hit it's like it's like you're in a hip hypnotized state, hypnotic state, let's go for that. So you don't realise how much time has passed, but you get that thought eventually of why am I still doing this? And I got that thought every single time and I thought nah, I got really angry and pissed off and closed the app and like threw my phone across the room. And the way I got myself to stop scrolling is that I reduced the amount of time each day that I spent I know it's going to sound really simple, but I would scroll for less and less each day. So and it wasn't a case of like one day I woke up and thought, well, I'm never going to, never going to scroll again because I was addicted. Like it's impossible for you to just quit off the bat. You slowly reduce the time you spend over the next few weeks slash months until you get to the point where you're spending like an, only an hour on it. Then you reduce that to half an hour and you keep doing that until eventually you maybe only use it for five minutes a day before you like stop and you put it down that is going to be you're good that's going to that's going to have such a drastic impact on your life if you get to that stage alone you don't even have to completely eliminate it to be honest if you just get to the point where you're doing it for five ten minutes a day and you were doing it for three hours look how much time you've got now to do something else look how less your mind is being manipulated by just bullshit. <laughs> absolute trash that is hurting your mental it's hurting your thought it's hurting your mental clarity we know this every every guy watching this knows that tiktok's bad for them they just can't seem to stop and that's therefore you've got to reduce it slowly over time less and less each day until you get to the point where you're doing five minutes and you can either decide to completely stop like i've done or you can just use it for five minutes because i mean it's not going to have that much of a detrimental impact but yeah, it's not easy. It's definitely not easy because it took me a while to get to this stage. But I'm so much, I'm so glad that I've done it because I remember the days I was just, I remember wasting so much time, bro. <laughs> so much time. And I now put it into some more productive things. So if this video helped you, um, drop a like and subscribe. And head over to my TikTok and follow me there. And I'll see you in a bit.